uh, Turkish team leading the way out here. They are young, aren't they? Like I said, how old do you think they are? Do you know? I put you right on the spot I here, haven't I? I don't know exactly. But uh, Gazos doesn't look like he's done his GCSEs. Uh, yet, I so think Gazos is 17. There you go. He's probably just finished his GCSEs yeah. as well. You know what I mean? The, the equivalent of. Yeah, I saw Ruben this morning though, uh, walking around fairly confidently. So, uh, how is he shooting nowadays? I think, I think he's. Uh, George is doing a great job of building up the crowd here. Just went a bit, uh, went a bit loud there. She doesn't look that happy to be here. No, she doesn't, does she? <laughs> Maybe she's a bit nervous. I'm sure she's, uh, I'm sure she's fairly happy to be here. Oh, there we go. We've got a smile. Ah. I mean, uh, she, uh, she did win a gold medal earlier, so uh, you'd like to think she'd be a little happier. <laughs> uh, so, she, yeah, she's got an opportunity to, uh, to take three medals today. Um, so obviously she's in the bronze uh, individual match later on. Uh, she's in the bronze medal match here. She's already won uh, won gold. Um, so a successful day for uh, Pavlova, uh, especially if she can uh, take a bronze here. It might not be Pavlova. That is a dessert, isn't it? So it's probably more like Pavlova. I keep saying it wrong, don't I? Okay, Turkey just take the lead here. Settling himself takes his time. That's the start you need. <laughs> yeah, clearly. Just yeah. on the line. I mean, uh, everyone has been uh, sort of uh, bigging up uh, Gazos uh, this week because he is uh, shooting so phenomenally well uh, for such a young guy as well. And he's just opened up at the 10 there. That's that unusual. One. I can't really yeah. say why it went up there. No idea. Uh, a lot of people seem to have struggled with their first arrows uh, on this stage. Um, but that's quite a long way out to be a sight mark. It is. Or like, to, for it to go high. Mm -hmm. yeah. Seems like a nice start. There we go. Opportunity here for Ruban. Ten here gives them a five point lead halfway through their. Uh, First set. Seems good. Yeah. Just nine. a little tall there. Yeah, we haven't got too many angles here, afraid of the target, but uh, we can confirm that it's a nine high. And Turkey have changed their order for their uh, for this bit. Is there any good reason to change an order, in your opinion? Obviously, you've done a lot of team events. Is there a seven? She's not started well there, is she? You might want the most confident archer to go up get a 10, get your team okay. going, and then have that same person. If there's a pressure shot, he's more likely to get the 10. Mm -hmm. OK. Um, she, doesn't, she, looks too happy. she looks a bit disgusted with herself, if anything. Um, but Gazo's just yeah. loves it's shooting 10s. <laughs> Makes it look so easy. He does, doesn't he? So, uh, 32 points on the board in the first set for Turkey is probably not going to be good enough, and uh, unfortunately, especially the way uh, Ukraine is shooting today. Good nine. Uh, so Ruben needs to get, uh, well, if this arrow falls anywhere inside the blue, uh, they can take this first set. Can fully, uh, fully expect uh, former Olympic champion to, to, uh, to do that. Looks happy. Nine. A couple of high arrows from him there. Uh, I don't think obviously it's not made any difference in this uh, particular set, but two high nines. We want to think about uh, moving his sight a little bit. Um, if you were Anna Goz now, how would uh, how do you sort of turn that around from the first two arrows there? She's going 12, obviously. You'd have to do a little bit of imagery, set yourself down. You, she knows how to shoot a good shot. She just needs to go and do it. Okay, very simple. The good thing about this set system, I think, is that it's uh, you can move on quite easily because obviously the scores now are set at zero. Um, if it was like uh, the compound day yesterday, it was cumulative score. If you were uh, five points behind after four hours, it can be quite difficult to come back from that. Yeah, they'd have to really fight to, yeah. for every point after that. Where now it's just a set. 
they can win and they can they can Come win and the win. next three and then win the match. Yeah, yeah very simple. So. Yeah, the weather's uh, the weather today's uh, managed to to stay dry. Um, we were expecting um, maybe not so nice weather today, but uh, well, I was, and I'm wearing shorts. But uh, I thought it was going to be a scorch of a day. But it's it's, uh, it's quite calm as well, yeah. surprisingly. I thought it would swirl around yeah. here quite a lot. It hasn't been too bad today. The weather is uh, is fairly good for shooting, in all fairness. Waiting for uh, the next set to begin. Turkey will take the lead, obviously, because they are behind. Let's see if she can turn it around now. Um, she's starting with a five uh, in the first hour. Not a good start, but she's had a chance to reflect on that, move a sight if needs be. Yeah, so we've got Anna Gold shooting first now. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they're changing the order a little bit. It's closer. She's getting there. It's a little on the high side. Yeah, she's moving her side now. Okay. Maybe she shot that first hour, first hour off the top of a button, or would that make a bit more difference than that? Would it would you miss? go high right. High right, okay. And probably would miss. Okay. See if you can follow his two tens up with another ten. High nine. Maybe an eight. Um, as, as I mentioned earlier, we uh, when the, the arrows are close to the line, we'll always suggest that it's the lower number. Um, so yeah, Turkey have got 18 on the board. Uh, sorry, 16 on the board there, but could quite easily be uh, an 18. So three eight so far. Um, like I say, Turkey's possibly can be uh, um, elevated to uh, nine nine. Um, but Ruben has an opportunity here to. Uh, Steady the ship and take some points. I'm, I'm going to suggest that one of Turkey's is actually closer to the line than there. we've suggested well, there. I thought the one was a nine. Yeah, so um, could could well be a tied situation right here. You can have another look in a minute. Yeah. A couple of tens from Turkey, though, would help. They are getting close to those lines, aren't they? <laughs> Her shot looks quite forced at the moment. Yeah. She needs to relax. Again, we put that down as a seven, um, possibly so an eight. This is a relaxed shot. Lovely. Lovely. It's a nine. Okay. So honestly, we don't really know what Turkey have scored <laughs> so far. I mean, they they could easily have an extra three points on top of what we've uh, we've put on the scores there. But uh, let's uh, hand it over to Ukraine now. See if they can capitalise. Good. 10 here and they've definitely won the set in my opinion. Yes, an unusual technique. Yeah, Moving describe that for us. Um, <laughs> Is that a 7 or an 8? Um, Ukraine not really taking advantage there in no. my opinion. I think uh, I think they could be a little shocked here by uh, by Turkey. I think um, if any of those Turkish ones are uh, close to the line, we may see the scoreboard change a little bit there. Although we could be wrong and they could all be uh, exactly how we've scored them. So, 33 there. I think I just heard George say they might get more. So yeah, you can see three asterisks six there next to those uh, uh, arrows, meaning that they can quite easily be uh, uh, elevated to the higher value. So, you know, Ukraine uh, throwing some high fives around there. I'm not too sure they've won this set, but be interesting when we get confirmation back from the judges. We're just trying to look out the tent and have a look. Nothing back as yet. I think they are just uh, really taking their time to make sure they, uh, they're making the right decisions because it is pretty close. Obviously, important decisions to be made by the judges here. If Turkey have this, they level the score, uh, level the match up. And by the sounds of it and the smiles that the, the Turkish I have think there. Turkey have got it. Yeah. If that's the case, I think uh, Ruben's going to be kicking himself a little bit. Uh, 
the seven yeah. there to uh, to finish the uh, the set. Not really good enough. We saw the uh, the, the gold medal team match earlier. Yeah, between, uh, it's two two. George just two -two. announced it. Fantastic. There we go. So. Um, they must have had all three of those uh, line cutters, or at least two of them, I think. Um, but yeah, as I was explaining there, we, we saw the uh, the Gents gold medal match earlier, and missing uh, missing the gold is can be detrimental, really, at the, at this level. So um, I fully expect these guys to uh, to rail it in a little bit. Hopefully, she's got a sight mark sorted now. Brilliant. Oh, there we go. <laughs> is that a relaxed shot, in your opinion? Yeah. Is that better? That was better. And she's smiling. And she's smiling. There we go. Gazos uh, is shooting well. Nice, just out oh, maybe. Another liner. They are getting close. To the uh, well, like I said, we've put it down as a as a nine could easily be a ten. Pressures uh, on Ukraine here because that's a good couple of arrows. Good yeah. stuff. I think uh, Ruben so far is uh, underperforming a little bit. I think he needs to step up here. I am a critical person, to be honest with <laughs> you. Uh, but, uh, um, yeah, I can be quite critical, but uh, same what I think. Nine. It's okay. It's okay. He's been carried, in my opinion, but uh, it's okay. They could be tied. They could be one behind, but... Uh, just need a couple of another, another two good shots from Turkey and they can take the lead here, I think. She seems happy. Walks yeah. straight off then. Yeah, she she uses her time quite quickly, doesn't she? Gazos here has then uh, got plenty of time just to settle in. It does look good, doesn't he? Nice. It's lovely. Fine, yeah. <laughs> Uh, good end, good end from that, Turkey. That's a really good yeah. set. Um, I think they've got 38. 38, 37. So if we assume it's 37, then two nines here uh, would tie it up. So they need a 10 and a 9 to, to take this. Yeah, oh, that's a 10. That's a 10, yeah. I think we can call that a 10 quite easily. Uh, scores have put it down as a, as a 9, but I think that's a 10. I think the scorers have got a dodgy angle. Yeah, it must I be. I think they might be struggling to see. Ruben. Oh, ten. ten. Finally. Um, yeah, they needed two tens, and uh, I think they've uh, I think they've got it. Yeah, I think they've got 39, mm. so they've definitely won that set. Yeah, we'll give them that one. Uh, the the line cutters this time, I don't think are going to make too much of a difference. Um, So, 4-2. So, the best Turkey can hope for here is a shoot-off, but uh, it's been a bit of a topsy-turvy match so far. I wouldn't put it past Turkey to uh, to take the next set. No, they'll be shooting first, so they'll, they'll be first up. If they get some good arrows in, they'll be putting the pressure on Ukraine, um, and it might be enough for them. Yeah, I've been talking about that all weekend, uh, the advantage of going first. It can be a disadvantage also if you, uh, if you shoot three bad arrows, or two bad arrows in this case. It can uh, it can sway it over and possibly uh, give the other team a boost. Maybe? Yeah, so, if, if it's yeah, if, if the first team has had a dodgy end, um, then the next what lot will you know they'll have yeah. confidence to, to go and beat it. Um, so yeah, it can go either way. Either way, but uh, but definitely two good shots will put the other team under pressure, and that's what you've got to be thinking. Think positive after all. So I think we're just getting confirmation of the uh, the scores there, and um, I think the line cutters have been a bit more important than I've made <laughs> out. Uh, looks like it could be three all. I uh, know it's not. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, she's got a bit of a smile on her face. Uh, the. Uh, the yeah, coach there, fist pumping, and so uh, it is a 4-2 lead for uh, Ukraine. Uh, Turkey will take the uh, the lead in this set. Uh, decisive set. Gazel's there trying to pump her up, I'm guessing. They need to win this set, so they need four good shots. There's not a lot of room for error in, in four shots, is there? No, the pressure is on. Mm -hmm. Nice and quick. Bit seven. 
that's an opportunity for Ukraine to take, really. Yeah, definitely. Need to ten here, I think. Nice. I mean, Ukraine, like I say, they have got an opportunity here, but uh, you know, they could quite easily Still, shoot a, a nine, and, a nine and, eight. and eight. Yeah. Um, it's not beyond the realms of possibility, but um, Pavlova here is uh, is shooting extremely well. I think she's, she hasn't missed the ten that many times. Nine. We have seen Ruben shoot uh, seven. Anything can happen. Anything can happen. Needs to be good. Yes, and it is 10. So, two point lead halfway through this set. Uh, Turkey really need to shoot two tens here. Uh, yeah, two tens, otherwise, it's probably not going to be good enough because uh, all all Ukraine needs is a tie here. Is that right? 5 3 for the match. Yes. Good 10 to start. Fantastic. Good recovery after that seven. Another 10, and they've got a chance to mm. make the Turkey. They really do need it here. I think uh, Gazzles is the man uh, to get this done as well for them. He's shot enough of them already today, yeah. hasn't he? There Fantastic we go. Fantastic shooting. Fantastic shooting from him. Fair play. Uh, right, game on. Two nines will win this for uh, Ukraine. Yeah, 18 points wins it. So. Ooh, there's the eight. It was a slightly weak, weak release there. And, uh, so to win this match, Ruben has to shoot a ten. Oh, it's a shooter. Ooh. Shoot off, so exciting. Do you fancy a shoot off, do, do you? Yeah, I think. Uh, he, is, uh, he does know how to shoot an arrow, but he hasn't been that consistent. Oh. Ten has won it. Wow, well, that's fantastic. He got it when he needed it. Yeah. That is, uh, that is some exciting archery right there. <laughs> Fair play. Just when the Ukraine needed it, he shoots the 10. So uh, that's uh, two out of two medals there for uh, pa Pavlova. Uh, so, yeah, full of confidence. I'm sure she is uh, going into her individual match later on this afternoon.